right, good morning. We got one more coming up here. Can you drop it in there? There you go. All right, and can you close it? Thank you. And you're going to pick it up. So it's out of the way. Good. Now, how many of you guys know a love song? I bet if I asked them, they'd all be able to say, oh, I know a love song. Do you know love songs? They're really popular out there, right? But I bet you do know the love song that I'm thinking of. But can you make a heart with your hands? Okay, let's make hearts with our hands. Can you take your hand and make it look like a C and then stand your thumb down? Make your other hand look like a C and you put them together and you've got a heart. Do we need to show these guys so they can see too? All right, guys, make your hand a C. Come on, you can do this. Make your other hand a C. Put them together, stretch the thumbs down, and you got your heart, right? You can look through your hands, huh? Can we look through your hands? Can you make a heart and look through and look at everybody out there with love? All right. Now, I am thinking of a song that I bet you know. And when I say the word or sing the word love, and you can help me sing it too, you're going to make a heart with your hands. And I know you know the song because it's usually one of the first songs that kids learn. Are you ready? Jesus loves me, this I know, for the Bible tells me so. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but he is strong. Ready? Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. Yes, Jesus loves me. The Bible tells me so. Isn't that a great song about love? I told you everybody knows that love song. It's such a special one. You know, Jesus taught the people, and all the crowds would gather in to come see him. They wanted to talk to him. They wanted to listen to him. They wanted to hear what he had to say. There was some other people that decided, he thinks he's so smart. I think I'm smarter. And so they would come, especially one of them. He was a religious lawyer. And you know what lawyers like to do? They like to argue. They want to they wanna argue, and they want to defend, and they want to. And so the religious lawyer, the scribe, came up to him and said, Jesus, what is the greatest commandment? And you know that if it's a lawyer, he's going to argue anything that you say, he's going to dis probably disagree with you, right? So Jesus answered him, and this is what he said. Now, if I say the word love, guess what you're going to make? Make your heart. Okay, so Jesus answered him, and he said, You shall love the Lord your God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your mind, and with all your strength. This is the first commandment. And the second one is like it. You shall love your neighbor as yourself. There is no other commandment greater than these. And you know what the lawyer said? You're right. So when you start thinking about love, those two things, love God with all your heart, with all your soul, with all your might, and then love your neighbor as yourself. And remember that for the rest of this week. Can you show love to somebody else? So look through your hands again. Can you make your heart? Look out there at all the people and show them love. You can go back to your seats now.